let's continue working on our menu. The next thing we're going to do is make rounded corners on the borders of the menu here. So the first thing we're going to do is paste in some CSS code. And this CSS code, this chunk of it down here, these rules, are standard CSS3 for making rounded corners. And this works great in all browsers except for IE8 and older. So if you have IE9, it'll be great. And actually, older versions of Opera doesn't work on either. So we'll show you a workaround for that. The next thing we'll do then oops, is make our menu join that CSS class. And we're making it a class because later on we'll have some other boxes that we want to have rounded corners on too. So we do that by doing the CSS class in the menu item. We don't use just class. Then the next thing we do, well actually, let's test this out now and show you what happens. So if we test this and take a look at it in Firefox, it looks like this. Nice rounded corners on the menu. Same thing, Chrome. We won't do Opera Safari, but it's the same look. The problem is, with IE, we don't pick that up. So to get rounded corners in IE, what we do is add in um, one of the Ajax controls. We want to add this rounded corners extender. So to do this, we'll do our normal add the script manager. If we do this on the master page, you want to make sure that this thing is inside the form. So I'm going to have to move this here in a second. Then the next thing we want to do is make sure that we register this. So I'm just putting this kind of standard line up here. And then the last thing we'll do is add in the, the Ajax round a corner extender. And the thing we want to check here is make sure our target control ID is set to menu one. And we'll see our radius here. The radius works a little bit different than it does in the other radius. Um, but we'll check this out in a second. So the last thing I want to fix here, there's actually two things I want to fix. I'm going to fix the script manager needs to go inside the form. So I'm just going to put it here at the very start of the form. And then the other thing I'm going to do is fix this class name. You shouldn't have dashes in your class names. If we ever have to refer to this stuff through JavaScript, the dash is going to mess us up. So I'm just going to clean this up now. Okay, so again, this code will work with all browsers except IE. The rounded, the Ajax control will make it work with IE, but we'll see it's going to kind of mess up all our browsers. But anyway, let's test this out. So we'll save this then refresh this over here. And so here's IE. You notice now it's got the rounded corners. It looks a little jaggy. And you notice it also it messes up our menu. So we're going to have to change some colors on our menu to make this palatable. And then let's go look at our other browsers just to make sure. So you notice it's kind of changed the height and it's made it that less pretty rounded corners here as well. Um, and same thing in Chrome. So Chrome is even worse with the size. It's messed up. Anyway, we'll come back and fix this. Or what you might do, and I'm kind of tempted to do this too, is just use the CSS one and say we're just going to have square corners here in IE because this is just really not looking as good as the other. So anyway, we'll end this one, the first part of the rounded corners.